And to be honest, the rest of the song kind of sucks. But that part's really good. We're ready. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to say a lifetime in the making, but honestly, it's probably been about two years in the making. We are absolutely live. Me and the team have worked hourless, countless hours, low sleep, a lot of work today. The launch is live, 3sb.co, good company, Third Street Barbell Clothing, um, the icon package. We're calling it the warm up, basically to give you guys an idea of who we are, what our branding looks like. Putting our logos out to the world um, feels good, it feels a little scary. Uh, we got two tees, two basketball shorts, three hats, a little keychain toy for you, and a top secret surprise, which we'll be dropping hopefully next week or the week after. But in this drop, um, we got kind of an athletic fit top, something you wear to the gym, train in, it's lightish, comfortable, uh, fits normal. Our basketball shorts, maybe we'll do like a little try on. That would be good. I was just going to put the website. I want to do like a little try on. We can do a try on, dude. I think we should do that. Uh, so the normal fit tees, I got one upstairs. I'll go put it on for you. Fits very comfy, athletic, light again. Uh, black and white with all our logos on there, the icons. We got these uh, unique basketball shorts all cut and sew, custom. Everything we're doing is one off. One, because I'm kind of sick and tired of being sick and tired. That's a good song. People say when you're creating a company, you try to fill a gap or fulfill a need that's not there. Um, the sun goes down at six o'clock at night. Some man uh, invented electricity and a light bulb. So then you could do be alive in the middle of the night and not be in the dark, right? Uh, Thomas Jefferson? Franklin? Edison. Franklin. Franklin and Edison? Franklin did Thomas the electric... Franklin. Franklin. Franklin discovered electricity. See, teamwork. Me and Marcus are just like Edison and Franklin. So we have that. So what my gap that I'm seeing in fitness is that, one, there's no clothes for lifters. Not that I'm going to go reinvent the wheel and create some shorts that I've never invented. But two, nothing calls to the type of clothes that I find comfortable or what I like to wear. Uh, I grew up in the basketball culture my whole life, 15, 20 years. How you look, how you play, how you feel, all those are so tied in. The nostalgia of streetwear, I got really deep into some nerdy streetwear clothing when I was in high school, which is like 2002 to 2007. Just aged myself there a little bit for you youngins. Um, but to have clothing that represents what I enjoy, food, my passions, fitness, music, the cultures, my city, tying that all in to the current product and future product is my goal. To not only have clothes that are functional that you can squat in, but you can also go grab coffee and you can grab a beer, you can grab a meal and not look like a mess. Um, to have a little bit of what my aged folks would call swagger. To have a little bit of drip, what your aged people might say. Uh, to feel good about yourself. And that doesn't necessarily mean, you know, no offense to my boy Omar. Not to wear stringers everywhere so my nipples are popping out so you can see my muscles, but to have a sense of style that is... Uh, what I enjoy. And so hopefully you guys relate to that. And if you don't, that's cool. Wear clothes that you like, wear clothes that make you feel good. And so me and my team have designed clothes that we like that makes us feel good. Um, and we feel like there's a lot of like-minded individuals out there. Third Street Barbell is the gym. It is the location. Third Street Athletics and Good Company, our slogan is in our branding. It is what we do. We believe in being like-minded, being around individuals that want to push each other, uh, that are positive, that can leave our differences at the door and focus on on our similarities, uh, to take care of each other, uh, to build something special together, to be a part of something. It looks like I'm reading my notes, but that's just how I think over here. Connor was thinking like, Mike, there's no notes there to read. I, this is how I work when I'm talking fast. Uh, to be a part of something bigger yourself, to be part of a team, to be have an ultimate goal, to have a common enemy. And in the case of fitness, in the case of our life, our common enemy, enemy is complacency we want to get better we want to get better together um so on the front of our tees i'll just go try it on but we've got a bear logo we're going to name them poor guys ain't got a name we're representing our city with it good company on the back third street barbell uh, which is our physical location that will allow us to better tell our story uh, whether it be through clothing 
through this YouTube channel, through my Instagram, or through our podcast. And that's really why we're building the physical location, to build a community, to tell our stories, which are ours and hopefully yours as well. I think we do a tryout now. I explained the clothing well enough. Yeah. You guys get a gist of what's going on. Because I don't know what the hell is going on. All right. So, three colors of the dad hat. It's going to be backwards. No? It says good company. Metal clasp. Full custom. Everything's cut and sew. Logo on the side. The Third Street 3. Does the 3 have a name? The Third Street 3? No. The Third Street 3. Same thing on the shorts. So these are like a semi-snug fit athletic. I like to think they're like a mid-90s. Growing up, playing basketball my whole life, my school was not heavily funded by any means. It was a private school, but there was no kids there, so there's still money there. <laughs> like, it doesn't matter if money's coming in because there just wasn't that many kids. So some of our jerseys were like probably five years old before the team would get new jerseys. I just know certain basketball teams or different teams would get jerseys every year. We didn't. So my freshman year, the varsity jerseys kind of fit perfectly like this. And I don't know why, even for lifting weights, it just happens to be cool now again to have shorts over your knees or on top of rather than like growing up, I had Jordans that were way down to here. And although that's comfy, I'm very happy and very lucky that it's cool again to wear kind of baggy clothes. So although these are like kind of a five inch inseam, which means like from your crotch to your knee, that's how long they are. Um, they're just above your knee, which I think is perfect for athletics. I think it still looks good if you got a little bit of a quad and you're trying to show it off. Um, the top, this is a 2XL. So I'm about 220 right now. I know, a little chunky. But it's kind of a very typical fit. I'm about 5'9", 5'10", 220. Shorts I have on are XLs. So they're not like mega baggy down here. Snug-ish, but still allowed to lift in. And with a 5-inch inseam. Hats, one size fit all. So it kind of works for anyone. Ladies as well for the shorts, it's kind of up to your style. I'm trying to make everything, obviously for me, and since I wear more dude-ish style clothes, uh, a lot of the shorts, hoodies, sweats that are coming out soon, uh, everything is unisex, but I think it'll fit probably a little bit better than these. These are kind of a, a, a small crotch, and I know ladies like to wear some, you know, don't tell me, or don't allow me to tell you what to wear, wear whatever you want, but they got kind of like some high waisties, um, but it's up to you. So these come in gold as well. You guys can see them along here. The tee comes in white. You can see it along here. The hat, we got a black one. I'll try to show you. And then a washed uh, dark denim. That's some of my favorite. So, the warm up drop, limited ish in the styles, but giving you a dose of everything we have. I don't know if you can see this tee behind me. I don't know how well this is doing, but there's the three on the back. Uh, custom everything, custom notches here. Oh, look at my camera work. You guys would be so proud. It says 3SB, represents who we are. Good company, represents what we do and what we believe in. Focus, little buddy. There we go. You guys can kind of see it. Connor, I'll chop it up for you. Um, and then same with the same with the top. We got the Good Company Bear, Good Company, 3rd Street, MMXX, Roman numerals for 2020, when everything's coming together. We got a keychain. And we're in the game. Bunch of stickers. Any purchase, we're going to throw you guys stickers, show you some love because you guys support us so, so much. After this drop, I got chaos coming. We're, we're prepping for a winter drop. So get it while you can. Everything, I don't know if I mentioned when Connor talked, is going to be one-off singularity. Single Singularity is when um, people reach AI, huh? So that's not what I meant. But they're all one-offs. They're single design. Um, one, because I want to create new cool shit, and two, to basically force me to be creative. Um, obviously, we create content, YouTube, podcast, Twitch, and all that. But a lot of those, I'm just being me, and I'm sharing my life, I'm sharing my information, I'm sharing my experiences. So the creativity isn't always there. For me to now step into the design world and something I've loved my whole life, clothes, streetwear, clothing, accessories, really is going to force me and my team to create new cool shit every couple of weeks. So that's the main goal, selfish goal, and for you to make something limited, something cool. Um, I'm not doing it to hype beast it out. We'll try to get as many people in our stuff as always. One, because it makes us money, duh. Two, because I want you guys to share in similar styles that if you relate and like what I like, if you like to dress like this, I want you to be able to access this at high quality, decent pricing. So. 
those are the reasons. That's the mission. I appreciate you guys so much. 3sb.co. We're live now. Check it out. And hopefully, I'm getting some equipment in the gym. Vlogs coming soon. Fitness, life, business. Appreciate you guys. Hope you have a good one.